What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Everybody, I had to bring it back. It's been, let's say, highly requested. This is gonna be video number three in reading mean comments. Let's get to it. But before we do, I wanna give a little disclaimer. There is some harsh language in here, a lot of obscenities, a lot of hate speech, a lot of just downright idiotic stuff. I just wanna let you guys know. Now we can get to it. Your body is disgusting. Why do people look up to these fucking virgin food eaters like Matt Stoney and Randy Santel? Congrats, you can eat food. Part of me wants to think that Randy Santel and Matt Stoney have probably gotten laid a thousand times more than this guy has. You're are losing it. You're are. Dude, do you even know how to structure a strength program? You're going to kill yourself trying to lift weight you clearly can't put up. LOL. Also, what the fuck is up with you using knee wraps and a belt for that light ass weight you are squatting? Ah, yes, I forgot. According to YouTube Fitness, you have to be squatting over three plates. Wait, no. Was it three plates? Was it four plates in order to be able to use wraps? I don't know, I can't really keep up with it. I'm sorry, man. This isn't a hate comment, but how much do you weigh? What I always say when people ask me how much I weigh is, scale doesn't measure sexy. What exactly are you cheating on your boyfriend? Your, 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 your. This guy isn't gonna live very long. You should try taking LSD and going for a nature walk by yourself. It'll open up your brain to new ways of thinking and possibly help you realize what is wrong. Eric, you are experiencing an existential crisis and the only way to remedy this situation is to experience ego death via high doses of psychedelic drugs. I highly recommend multiple tabs of good clean LSD. Eric, I would recommend copious amounts of LSD. Best of luck with your depression. I've been battling mine my whole life. What the hell is up with all the LSD comments? Jesus. I'm not watching your videos because you curse. Fuck. Shit. Ass. Dickhead. Shit balls. Clickbait motherfucker. Go kill yourself. Dude needs to get laid. 48k calories, why? Don't do the calories challenge, do the fitness challenge instead. It costs the world and global resources for that calories. 30k calories, huh? Don't do the calorie challenge, do the fitness challenge instead. It costs the world and, oh my goodness, I don't think the guy realizes that uh, he's probably not contributing this whole epidemic with the laptop he's using to type the comments on. I couldn't even focus on what he was eating because all I could think about was how he needs to wear way more sunscreen when he goes riding. Those wrinkles are already coming in harsh, dude. Yep, look at those wrinkles, guys. 23 going on 53. And people will still be saying I look like I'm 14 tomorrow too. Gotta love YouTube. I don't like your personality and you're an arrogant fucking asshole, LOL, says Mark from the UK. Well, Mark, I'd really love to know when you've met me in person. Change background music, please. Sounds like rejected Super Mario music. Do something less edgy and more free flowing and melodic. Hold on. Let me turn on my preferred music for a second. I swear, you could do competitive eating. LOL, what kind of weirdo does competitive eating? What the hell is competitive eating? People actually do that? That's not cheat day, that's future diabetes. Yeah, I spelled it wrong on purpose. Right, because one day of eating a ton of sugar is gonna make you have diabetes. I don't think you should be doing cheat days, bro. You look extremely ill, like you have a disease and dying. Take care of yourself more. Thanks, dude, I'll try. The top real food challenger champs eat and they clean up their plates. No crumbs or leftovers of any type. I highly recommend you go and watch a competitive eating contest with rice. Just go check it out. Matt Stoney wannabe, ha 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 ha. Who the hell is this Matt Stoney guy? Please do and stop crying. I'm 100% sure you just need to get laid. What happened to that skinny chick you were implying that you were banging? Did you blow it? Did you fall in love immediately like a bitch and then get rejected? Be honest, lol. By Sean Kingston. You're way too beautiful, girl. Damn. Forever single, forever single. I've never seen a YouTuber with so many ups and downs as you. It's like every other week you go for the sympathy card. Seriously, people, we'll just click onto another station. Just say you're done and seriously go away. You've contradicted yourself on this channel so many times. You're celebrating your 100,000 subs. Now you're complaining about all your pressure from your videos. 
You are not sane enough to have followers, nor are you a celebrity. Go get a shrink, get on some meds, and STFU. Nobody cares what you're like or what you stand for. When you constantly change what you say about yourself, then you are nothing. Every other video, you are depressed as fuck. Listen, people, watching this fool will depress you. Unsub today. One more. P.S. He's playing you with people like puppets. He gets off on how many people that he doesn't know. Say things like, oh, sorry you're feeling bad, Eric. I hope you feel better soon, Eric. Please get some help, Eric. He's all playing all of you. The more he thinks people are crying over his sadness, the more he gets off to it. Wake up, fools, and unsub to this idiot, or the next thing he'll have you doing is crying over a phony suicide attempt. Fuck off, Eric, you jerk. A good kick in your childish ass is what you need. I don't think someone likes me very much. Try to get laid. You don't look like the guy that gets laid, Barrett. <laughs> Try to get laid. You don't look like the guy that gets laid very much. Hashtag virgin. Meanwhile, this is made by Can't Wait For Some Changes. Shout out to Can't Wait For Some Changes, guys. Shout out. <laughs> I'm 13 and eat five times more sushi than this guy. It's my fucking jam. And I'm not fat either. Mr. Durian Ryder says, carbs, mate. Cops. I guess I'm just gonna go keto, guys. Fucking loser bitch. Get some better lighting, you fucking imbecile. Get it together. Deal with your problems rather than posting them online. This Domino's will be open Thanksgiving Day. Be sure to call or order online for some great deals. Our next available team member will be right with you. Thank you for choosing Domino's. This can be a delivery or carry-on. Uh, it's gonna be a uh, delivery. Okay, I got uh, Derek. Is it customer? That's right. Yeah, I'm having like this really huge dilemma, man. Uh, I can't figure it out. I, I've been eating your pizza for a while now, and I just want to know, is is your cheese vegan? Alrighty, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed number three. Alright, everybody. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. This has been video number three in Reading Mean Comments. Definitely let me know what you guys think down below. I like having a lot of fun with these. I just get so many different comments, and you know, sometimes I like to read them and have some fun with them. Do me a favor, guys. Give the video a thumbs up if you haven't already. Feel free to follow me on my social media, Facebook, Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram. You know the drill. Thanks again for watching the video, guys, and go ride a bike. Vegeta, what does the scouter say about his power level? It's over 9,000! What, 9,000? Uh,